Hello, good morning. I live in Pune. That's in India. Is the sixth most congested city in the world. Even though Pune is the most livable city in India, the increasing traffic is polluting the air every single day. Because of all of this, it takes me 45 minutes to just go to a place that's eight kilometers away. To solve these issues, Pune now has its own metro. It reduces congestion by providing a fast and reliable alternative to road transport and reduces travel time. So now we've booked the rickshaw. We are going to Shivaji Nagar Metro Station. So the place where we are going at right now is Shivaji Nagar Metro Station. So Pune ke jo do metro station hai, Shivaji Nagar and Civil Court. These two stations are underground and baki sub are over the ground of course. But we are here at the office right now. So in this vlog, I'm experiencing the Pune metros and I'm also accompanied by a guy who's working on this project. The construction of Pune Metro began in 2018 and happens in phases. The construction is 75% complete and is expected to be fully developed by 2024. I'm not gonna lie, it's just as good as the metro stations in London and New York. It's really a moment of pride for me. It's really good and surprisingly, it's not a lot So maybe people are not using it enough yet. But maybe after this video, you guys will use Pune Metro as well or at least experience it. For the Pune Metro project, we have three lines. The purple line goes from Pimpri Chinchot to Swar Gate. The aqua line or the blue line goes from Vanas to Ramwadi. And the orange line goes from Hinjavadi to Shivajinagar. The orange line is still in construction and not usable by the public. So, we bought a ticket for 20 rupees each to go from Shivajinagar station to Civil Court station. Pune Metro coaches are nearly 6% lighter than all other coaches in the world as they are the first ones to be made by aluminium. The Pune Metro moved more than 2,000 trees that were in the way of the train tracks. But they also used a special method to let the trees be moved without hurting their roots. One metro can carry about 900 people which is amazing. The metro stations are designed in such a way that they tell the story of Pune and are Peshwa themed. They also allow cycles on the metro that let commuters travel from the stations to their destinations. Now we are in which is the deepest metro station in all of Asia. So one of the major challenges for metro stations is the air conditioning over there. But this is how Pune Metro is solving it. We have nozzles over here. And it's throwing some nice cold air over here. Keeps the entire station cold. So understanding how metro is made is pretty interesting too. It's not an easy task. So for example, I'll give an example. In this metro station, this was over the ground. And Nietzsche Abhidhar Hamara Pune ka train station hai. So this over a bridge had to be built without disrupting the train ka service jo Nietzsche hai. So it's pretty hard and very interesting also. The amount of effort that go in building a metro, it's crazy. The Civil Court Station is the hub of Pune Metro Station and is the interchange station. The Civil Court Station also has a transparent roof so that the commuters can get a feeling of the weather outside and also save on electricity costs. Until now, I only knew about metro stations and metros, but I also got to know about the challenges that are faced during the constructions. So from Civil Court, we headed back to Bopodi. That's the station that is the closest to my house. While going back, I also could see my house. In fact, I could also see my room. The cost of the Pune Metro project is about a whooping 13,000 crore Indian rupees that is about 1.7 billion dollars. Over 30,000 people have directly worked on this project just to get you from place A to place B. A lot of effort has gone in making this project a success, so do travel by the Metro and remember to thank anyone who has worked on this project. If you like this video and you want to see more of these videos, you know what to do, do like, share and subscribe and I'll see you in the next one.